Hello everyone welcome to back my channel I hope everyone is having a wonderful day before starting the video please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Season 10 of Chrisley Knows Best is returning. Given the circumstances, this one literally took the spectators by surprise. It appears that Todd and Julie, the main pair, are currently incarcerated, serving their 19-year total sentence. They were charged with many offenses, one of which being tax evasion. But the most current season was filmed prior to the two departing to complete their sentences. I in fact, Nanny Fay is the only one directing attention away from the accident amidst the mayhem. She was seen asking questions about a man who was the same age as her grandson in a recent video. Continue listening because we have all the information you could ever want to know these days. The Chrisley Knows Best program is handling a lot. It has been a month since the famous kids had to deal with Todd and Julie's absence while they served their time back in January. On the other hand, because they expected the show to return, the audience is ecstatic that it has. Todd and Julie are still at liberty and living with their families according to the timeline of season 10 Chase Chrisley and his father visited their new home in a recent video when the interior was being drywalled. At first, while drywalling like a builder, Chase made the decision to record a video chat to his grandmother and give her a tour of the house. Nanny Faye promptly answered the phone, and Chase proceeded to give her a tour of the premises. After drywalling, he said to her, the construction now resembles a house. After telling his grandmother that he had to go to work, the famous child gave his dad the phone. According to TV show Sace, Todd also offered Faye a brief tour of the residence. In the midst of this, she noticed a man who was drywalling alongside the father-son team observing quickly, Nanny instructed her son to return to that man. She went on to say that the man had a great appearance. Todd apparently said the man was even younger than him since he couldn't believe his mother. The famous person continued by saying that he is now old enough to be her grandson. Todd's remark is ignored by Faye Crisley, who asserts that although he could be, he isn't. In order to avoid being even more embarrassed in front of a stranger, Todd chooses to end the call. It's obvious that Faye believes age has no bearing on love, Crisley no best, has always had a soft spot for Nanny Faye. She always manages to capture the interest of her audience with her captivating charm. Her relationship with Chase is also commended. The two are often getting into mischief together, and Chase is down for anything with his adorable nanny. He also assisted her in entering the dating scene but lately, the matriarch has had a lot on her plate, after receiving a bladder cancer diagnosis, nanny Faye is currently taking medication, she also had to see her son sentencing to prison. The last time fans saw nanny, Chase was tying the knot with his girlfriend. Faye hasn't appeared in public for a long because she just occasionally attends family events. Nonetheless, people enjoyed her chat with Todd more than the mail and left positive comments in the comment section. One fan wrote, hoping that Nanny will continue to be included on the show because she is so fascinating. One more person weighed in, complimenting Faye on her return. For all of the most recent Chrisley Knows Best tea, Subscribe to the America People News YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our America People News YouTube channel for more update news.